All right, it is a beautiful day up here, Culberson County Airport. Just some light winds and a really sunny day. So today should be pretty fun. Just gonna go clean up Kitbox 1000, get some air in the tires, just kind of get an overall look of what needs to happen right now. Also excited to announce, probably have already seen, but I now have the Stoll t-shirts. I've got a new line of t-shirts. I've got several other designs. This is one that I'm really happy about, really excited to show you guys. You guys can check out the link in at the end of this video there'll be a card or you can check out the link in the description if you want to get one yourself the 10 percent of the proceeds of these go to support the mission aviation fellowship the mission aviation fellowship is a nonprofit that is really near and dear to my heart because they use aviation to spread the gospel and medical supplies and disaster relief to people in third world countries who don't have access to those kinds of things so yeah enough talking let's go get in there with the airplanes all right guys so before we get into this video, I really just wanted to take a minute and shout out to give a shout out to Al Sibby and Steve Renfro. So Al Sibby is a great guy here. He owns a couple other planes here in the hangar, including that cool Quicksilver MX over there. Anyway, so Al gave me just a ton of fabric to recover the wings on Kit Fox 1000. So as you probably know, the Kit Fox 1000 is previously covered with a polyfiber process and painted with a urethane product uh, an incredibly hard to remove paint but I'm now planning for Kip Hawk 1000 to go with the Stewart system and the Stewart system is a water-based setup this stuff was sent to me by Steve Renfro Steve thank you so much he sent me this uh, a while ago now he sent me the irons a brand new iron here and uh, paint brushes uh, the glue some glue to try out roll of fabric roll of um sorry pink tape and the um, fabric itself so this is pretty neat thank you so much steve thank you so much al for sending me this for those who aren't familiar with the stewart systems process here's a rudder that al has actually covered with the stewart systems uh product and that same fabric uh, and it's basically just a water-based glue and that you set down and then you use an iron and it uh it, it sets with heat so when you put apply heat to it, it uh, sets. So you go like this, and then from that point on, it's pretty much your standard um, like a polyfiber covering process, except that it uses um, less toxic chemicals and solvents and stuff. So yeah, pretty neat. Thank you so much, Al and Steve Renfro, for giving me this fabric and the tools for the fabric. Thank you guys so much, and thank you to everybody else who are uh, patrons and sponsors, donors, people who have donated. Um, part supplies and even funds to make this possible. Thank you guys so much. Uh, let's get on with the rest of the video. All right, so what I've decided I'm gonna do is along here, there's these bolts and these are holding in this broken piece of acrylic. I'm gonna pull all these little bolts and pull the acrylic off. All right, so what I'm doing now is I've got this tube here that needs to get straightened. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put this 
steel bar up here. I'm gonna grab this big fat T clamp. I'm gonna clamp it on there and squeeze. So I tighten that, you might not be able to see it. There's a strap here. As I tighten that and try to straighten this, that should straighten a good portion of the frame. Alright, now this is going to be, I know this sounds kind of crazy, but I've got this bar clamp here, set up with some um, spring clamps. The idea being is I've got this clamp to this truss here, i got these clamps to this bar clamp, and when I rotate that handle, it should pull it up, and these should hold it to the clamp, and it should pull it up. Well, I'll take that as a no. Well, I better start packing it up for the day. It's starting to get late. But yeah, I'm going to go ahead and leave it off here. Remember, if your style is still, don't forget to check out the link in the description below or on this card here to get your own My Style is Still t-shirt or just a plain stool with the new brand redesign. Thank you guys so much for watching. Big shout out to these patrons. Patrons get early access to videos and updates and their own special line of t-shirts. So go check that out if you want to become a patron. Alrighty guys, like, subscribe, and share. And I will see you guys in the next video.